Hello guys and welcome back to the channel. We're going to do a mix pull push workout today. But before we get started, I want to mention something to you about shorts. Shorts are little videos that we put up 15 to 30 seconds, sometimes 60 seconds. And they don't have much uh, value really for calisthenics, but what they do have a lot of value when it comes to YouTube and promoting your channel. So, though I have little to no interest in making shorts, I'd rather make a full video for your enjoyment and so you could work out with me and get stronger. The shorts are there for the purpose only of promotion. They're gonna be a little odd, a little strange. They'll have music. And the point is that YouTube will endorse the shorts before a regular video so that's how it goes I have if you look at the shorts if you go over some of my uh, shorts folder you'll see that the shorts get thousands upon thousands of views while the regular videos do not so keep that in mind when you see the shorts that I'm not trying to be cheap on the workout it's for promotion purposes thank you very much so guys get a set of resistance bands okay this is going to give you a little bit of an edge when you're working out i'll show you what i mean as a warm-up i'm going to use a resistance band to get a muscle up observe So, although I can do a muscle up without a resistance band, the point is that you're warming up your shoulders and you're getting the movement, the muscle memory needed, and you're doing it in a safe way. If you just jump up on the bar from a cold start, try to do a muscle up or pretty much any of the more intense exercises, you're going to hurt yourself. Maybe not the first time, but eventually. Got it? Let's switch to a lighter band now. You see this band? It's thinner. That's what's good about these bands. You can get them online, they're very cheap. And now each time you use a thinner band, you're using more and more of your own body weight. It's great. It's just absolutely the best way to warm up. Hey, no. Okay, we're going to continue on. We're going to go to even a lighter band now. This band is extremely light, maybe a half inch thick. 
This is the lightest they make. So you also can do multiple muscle-ups, and remember this works for pull-ups as well, right? So same thing. You can do multiples of it, not just one rep like I'm doing here. You can do 10 reps, 15 reps. This is going to boost your overall muscle-up capability, right? You're doing higher percentage. So let's say you do five reps of a regular muscle up. That's your max. You can't beat it, no matter how hard you try. Well, you do the five, then you spend the next half hour with the resistance bands. When you come back to the bar next time, you're gonna see you picked up a couple of more muscle ups. And that's because when you thought your body was done and you thought the workout was over because you could only do the five muscle ups, by using the resistance bands, you kept going and kept building on the muscles. Okay? So here goes. Okay, now we're without the uh, band. Now for a military style pull up. This grip is the supernated grip pull up. This pull up is off the rings. And the hand position is the pronated grip. Now for the supernated handhold. This is the easier version ring pull up.
This is the advanced version rope pull-up. This is the standard rings push-up. And this is the parallel bars dip. And then we're gonna move right over into the single bar dip. And this is the typical pegboard workout. 